So I just picked this project up from somebody that was looking to sell it. Uh, it has been partially started, but really just in the very, very, very beginning stages of construction. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna unbox this, show you guys what goes into an angle model. A 1 100th scale, it's a big boat. Uh, I think it's about 65 or 68 inches overall length, certainly fitting for a boat of the Typhoon size. So let's break into these boxes and see what's inside. Right, here we go. I'm happy to introduce to you uh, the first generation of Engel Typhoon kits in 1 100th scale. This particular kit was replaced with what Engel calls their master scale kit and that uh, implemented a bunch of accuracy changes to the hull and it also implemented some additional scribing on the hull to represent the anechoic tiles which are very, very cool. Of course, you can't really see them when you're uh, further away, but once you're close, adds a lot of realism to the model. This particular version, the first one, is still absolutely amazing. Like I said, uh, I believe it's 68 inches in overall length. It's just a beautiful boat. Uh, I've built two of these so far, and this will be the third one. Let's take a look at the different components. First, we got the main hull. Got a little bit of damage up on the nose. That'll be really easy to address. We've got a nice thick layup, probably between an eighth and three sixteenths of an inch thick. This particular boat has also had all of the drain holes opened up and it looks like it did actually a pretty good job on these. Uh, it is one of the most labor intensive parts of putting these models together, cutting and filing all of those holes. Moving on, you can see the main components of the ballast system. This is a twin 750 milliliter capacity piston tank system that Engel developed. Uh, they call it a TA825. Uh, so actually maybe this is 825 mil capacity. You got some periscope, operational periscope components. There is the um, actual hardware that the masts connect to. And then you've also got the uh, electronic and motor system that it connects to. A bunch of miscellaneous uh, electronics, switches, you've got the main dive control board, hoses, plumbing, we got our brass props in there. Basically this is a brand new kit, just barely started. We've got the pressure sensor, part of the dive system allows you to monitor depth, uh, not only as a fail safe, uh, but for hover mode as well. Got our main drive system here, twin output geared drive system, all of our resin fittings, prop shrouds, uh, rudders and so on, uh, equipment trays, um, miscellaneous plastic, uh, brass fittings and all of that kind of thing. Uh, moving on here we've got a full set of instructions that the previous owner put together and printed out, step by step installation instructions. And this is the main watertight box. Uh, this is exceptionally thick layup, um, probably between uh, you know three sixteenths and a quarter inch thick with steel reinforcement. The thing is absolutely bulletproof. Aluminum lid, typically what I like to do is replace that aluminum lid with uh, acrylic or, or polycarbonate so that you can see what's going on and additionally I really like to cut additional accesses so that it makes it easier for installation and maintenance of the model afterwards and you can see that in some of my previous builds. So there you go everyone this is the Engel Russian Typhoon model kit in 1 100th scale. This is something that you think would interest you as a model for yourself by all means get in touch with me we'll see what we can do uh, to sell you a kit or to get one built for you. For now, thanks for joining me again. I'm Bob Martin with the Nautilus Dry Docks. Look forward to seeing you again. Thanks for joining me.